Hello guys, welcome back to an episode of Terraria. As always, this is Jason, and I just made up the Hellstone bars from the last episode. I still don't, I need more obsidian to finish making them all, but I got 57 here, and I did say the next thing I was going to do was make the helmet. 7 defense versus 6 defense. It's not a big deal. Um, I almost might should wait until I get all three pieces, just because I'm breaking up my set bonus. And 15% melee speed is kind of cool. What else, what else can I make? That takes 35, that takes 35, and that takes 25. <clears throat> well, I said I hate breaking up my set bonus, but I do like things that glow. I don't know if I make that, then I can get rid of my hammer and my axe, but I don't, I don't, I don't think that's a high priority. Just like I don't think that's making this is a high priority. Um... I mean, you guys know how much I love a pickaxe. 65% pickaxe power versus 100. Oh, uh, I'm going to have to make that. <laughs> uh, you, you know I'm addicted to the pickaxe anyway, so <laughs> I guess there's no real big surprise. That's what I'm doing. Uh, <laughs> let's, put, let's put this one away here. I'm going to try to do a much better job of not throwing away items and uh, never picking them up. Like, I don't know, let's say a... Uh, Oh, that thing is badass. It swings really fast with this armor too. But yeah, let's say like a mini shark. <laughs> um, I'm gonna. G I still don't have enough gold to buy them. The speaking of the mini shark, I still don't have enough gold to buy one. You should get a discount on your second one. Um, <laughs> especially if you threw the first one away. I donated it to charity. Uh, I'm gonna go farm up. There's three meteorites this way. I'm gonna go farm those up. I'm not gonna record it. You guys have seen everything there is to see about a meteorite. You know the. You know the gist of how it all works. Uh, so. I'm gonna go farm that up, sell some uh, meteorite, save enough for to make some ammo if I so desire, as well as make all the items that I'd want to make using the meteorite, uh, such as the uh, star cannon. I think it takes 20, which I probably already have 20 actually, uh, but whatever. Um, that's for me the easiest, best way to make gold is selling meteorite. There might be a better way, but. For me, so far, in my opinion, the best way is selling meteorite. Uh, so that's what I'm going to go with. Because one stack sells for like 14 gold, I think. Uh, meteorite bars, that is. Um, and since I have so many meteors down and I, ha I, don't have, I don't have enough uses for meteorite as I do uh, a plethora of meteorite. So, man, this new pickaxe is even better. <laughs> I can one-shot things. Um... I'm probably jumping ahead as far as tier goes. You know, just kind of like when I went to the jungle, there wasn't as many things in the jungle for me because I had already gotten uh, better stuff. Um, but the, I think the vine is really the only, the only thing in the jungle that you really, really, really want. Uh, I know that there's jungle armor, but the armor I have is already better, and I've pretty much got it worked out what I need to do in hell to farm the hellstone, and I got obsidian farm, so there's really no reason for me to go farm the jungle the jungle uh, armor. I'm cutting the grass just some more. Uh, and you know, I don't know if cutting the grass is required to make mushrooms spawn or not. I don't know if mushrooms will spawn where there's already grass growing. Who knows? I'm sure I'm sure someone will tell me. Oh, look, a pinky. Hello, pinky. I want to kill you. Oh, shit. Um, <laughs> he hit me in the face. Oh, yes, your gold is delicious. Uh, so anyways, like I said, gonna go from some meteorite. I'll be back with you guys in a bit. Hey again, guys. So a patch has happened. Uh, we are at 1.0.5. Um, I have not played recently at all. I've been super busy. Um, hadn't, haven't hardly had any time to play much of anything. Uh, so, oh, the price of the mini shark went down. Sweet. <laughs> I uh, apparently just saved 10 gold by not playing in a few days. That's crazy. Awesome, I guess. Crazy awesome. Uh, let's, let's put this money back away here. Uh, where's my meteorite? Tell me. I'm gonna immediately turn this into the the upgraded version, the star cannon, for my 194 stars. And a lot of recipes, a lot of shit has changed since I last played. Um. Why does it say Ivy Whip up there? Oh, it shows you what I'm holding in my hand now. That's cool. Whatever. How do I make a star cannon? 
What's that? That's leather. That's no star cannon. You have to go down here. I guess I'm gonna make a ham axe too. I was thinking about that earlier. Well, how the fuck do I make a star cannon? Hmm. And yes, everyone, I know that I fucked up and I sold meteorite to buy bullets. <laughs> um, I am now aware. I've, I've messed up a lot of times. I threw a stupid uh, gun on the ground. I um, sold all my bands of star power. I didn't realize that you could, those things stacked. I don't know how to make a... Uh, let me if I go up here and talk to this guy. I'm pretty sure it's just meteorite. Do you now have... No. Nah. You don't have anything for me. All right, I'm gonna go look at the wiki, figure out how to turn that into a star, star, machine gun or whatever. I'll be back in a minute. Okay, so it takes, it takes fallen stars as well. Whatever. You know, I have things organized in a certain way. It makes absolutely no sense, and I have no idea where I put stuff. All right, let's go ahead and grab. Just grab all these. And. On the star cannon. What's that? Oh, bow powder. I don't, I don't know what that's used for. <laughs> I think it's used to uh, to combine to summon something. I don't really know. There she is. Sixty damage. That's that's a lot. That is a big number. Alright, so let's make this ham axe too. Even though it's not the best one. I don't think I have... I mean, it's been so long since I've played, I really just am... unfamiliar with... I do have some hellstone left. What else can I make with it? See, I could make that. What's the difference? 150 axe power, 70% hammer power versus 100 axe power, 60%. it's not much difference honestly. But why not just make that one and be done with it? Though I could make that. I don't ever use it, but uh, I think I made some unholy arrows the other day when I was considering going to fight a Skeletron. So I might do that. I might make that and that way if I if 189 fallen stars isn't enough to kill him with the star cannon, hopefully I don't go over there and fail miserably, then uh, I can have a backup of Molten Fury to shoot unholy arrows. Hmm, I think that's what I'm going to do. Stick that there. And I guess I'll go ahead and make the this ham axe too. Cause I don't really have much use for the meteor other than meteor shot, so yeah. And then now that I've done that I can get rid of this and this. I'll just stick it in a chest somewhere. But yeah, as promised, I'm gonna go fight Skeletron. Pretty much right now. Um so I'll be back with you guys once I'm over there. It is nighttime and I'm about to pull him. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Alright, I'm back over here. And, uh, what the fuck is that? I don't know what that is. Oh, shit! That bastard shot at me! Ow, you motherfucker! <laughs> that wasn't cool, man. Thought we were friends. Alright. Um, hopefully, I have plenty of time to do this in. I don't really know um, how long it's going to take uh, to kill this bastard. Um, I don't think I really need the whip. So here we go. One, two, three. Huh, it doesn't light the unholy arrow up when it shoots it. It's strange. Alright, let's go ahead and re add that. Eat one of those to get back to full health. And oh shit! I 
How do you hit him with them? Okay, my aim is really bad, apparently. I guess you gotta hit the hand, specifically. Kinda like... Send it, like, through him. Okay. Let's hit the hand, specifically. Oh, shit, I thought, I, thought I, I thought I got back to the hit, the thing. <laughs> he doesn't really hit that hard. Like, does he get more badass at some point? I mean, I might have just waited till I don't even come after this guy. Hand of the star. to hit something because <laughs> I was no longer yeah I've almost killed this guy's head like I'm not even like trying that hard <laughs> and the fallen star over here Fremont said I should try to come with unholy arrows, um, not worry about the star cannon. I was like, well, if I can make a star cannon, why not? What happens if you just kill his head? Oh, I guess that's what happens. Cool. Well, that was cool. Alright then. That cactus right there hurts. You should not run into it. Alright, so what did I get out of that guy? Oops. Shit. See, that's how I, that's how you lose things. You, you got the wrong window open, and or you got your inventory window open, and you're uh, you just throw stuff on the ground like you don't want it or something. Well, that wasn't that bad at all. And you guys are probably like, well, yeah. And I I read they nerfed him too in this patch, but whatever. <laughs> so what did he give me? Nothing. Does that guy drop not drop anything? I guess he does have a a uh, a dungeon under him full of full of cool things, so I guess I should not bitch. All right, so first things first, let's put our piggy bank in our in our home here somewhere. There we go. He did drop five gold, which is cool. Gold's cool. Can't go wrong with gold. It's like a birthday present. Can't go wrong with money. Alright. Now then, what do we not want to worry about carrying with us down into this dungeon? Because I want to have plenty of room to gather cool things. I almost should I wish I'd have brought another one of those. I guess you can just Yeah. Just pick it up and take that shit with you. I did Okay, so I said I did get it, right? <laughs> uh Yeah, I'll just carry that around and drop shit in as I need to. That works. Alright, let's uh let's go check out this dungeon. And a lot of people are telling me that they haven't they've had a hard time finding Let's plays that go through the dungeon. I don't know why that is. Uh, I intend to go through the dungeon. Dungeons, dungeons are awesome, <laughs> as you see me <laughs> rave about in Minecraft. So, how's it going, zombie? I've heard there's all kinds of crazy stuff in this thing. So, let's uh, let's go see what what there is to be had. I want I wanted to make some cool armor that glows. But I didn't, so I don't have any core armor the glow, so we're gonna have to rely on that ball of light that just went out. Um But that's the next thing I'll do after we go through this right here is I'll go get I mean there's so much stuff that just got added to the game that I don't even know about. Like I read the change log, but uh there was so much stuff it was ridiculous. One thing I didn't know someone told me the other day is every oh hey. 
Every dungeon's different colors. Hey, what's that? Cursed skull. Man, there's lots of mobs in here. What's he called? I didn't get to see his name. There really shouldn't be heart containers in the dungeon, I've decided. What is up with that? Is that can I take that? I can. Cool. Spikes are cool. Jesus. Big bones. There's a lot of mobs in here, I can already tell. I want the water candles. I like the water candles. They should attract mobs if they're placed, too. Like, if you have them in your house or something, they should just attract mobs. I think... I think I read that Water Bolt is the only... the only spell that, uh... comes from the books. But there's other spells that are in chests and stuff, but not from the books. But I, I still want the books too. Books are cool. That bastard just spawned in my face. Are these different? Or are these just special for down in here? Or did they change that in this patch? I guess I won't know until I'm somewhere else. Lots of heart containers in here. I guess if you don't have all your hearts by the time you come in here, then you will by the time you leave. Like, these things don't do anything. They just piss you off because they're like looking at you. It's like, stop looking at me, crazy skull. I don't want you to look at me. Ow. Stop that. <laughs> I will murder you all. So I hit 3,000 subscribers today. I'd like to thank all you guys. That's awesome. Um, I uh, never really begged for the subscribers, so I appreciate you guys that have subscribed. Um, tells me that you actually like my stuff. Um, yeah, that's one thing I don't know. I never have understood about people that do the whole sub for sub thing. It's like you don't really know if you're reaching anyone. It's like, do you just like to see numbers? <laughs> it's like, I could put numbers in Notepad. <laughs> that's what I wanted to see is numbers. Oh, I got another door here. Oh, and a chest. Chest, chests are cool. Chests are our favorite thing. <laughs> For like Oprah. <laughs> What's in the chest? <laughs> uh, same old shit, man. I cannot get anything new in this game. It's just... Uh, it's just sad. Just sad. I was deciding when I was going to go back and get the chest and put, put down my... Uh, um, <laughs> my piggy bank. And... Putting all that stuff away, blah blah. But these things are retarded. Like, what? What is the point of these things? You wouldn't even have seen that chest if you didn't have light. You know, why? Why is my light not out here? <laughs> have you guys been wondering that for some time now? I had not noticed. There's a lot of mana potions in here. You know, that's something I've never made. Is a mana potion. Oh, you can just right-click the water candles to pick them up. I did not know that either. What about books? No, not books. I wonder why you can right click water candles. Do you guys know? If so, tell me. There's certainly a lot of books in here. Man, you get water bolt all the time. Shit. That's not what I meant to do. Or that. Damn, I'm bad. Alright, come up here and die. Very nicely. Damn, I knocked the hell out of him. Maybe they made it where you can right click on the water candle so you don't have to keep changing your stuff. What was that? Feather fall potion. That's something new. I think that just got added in the patch. Man, that's a lot of uh, faces all of a sudden. If I, I sort of open that chest over there and it's the same old crap, I'm going to be pissed off. Uh, you guys are going to talk shit about how easy it was for me to kill Skeletron. I know it. I just know you are. Fucking hell, man. It's just it's just wrong. It's not fair. <laughs> it's not fair. I wonder if uh or if any of these are new mobs. I don't think I, I don't think Big Boned or uh the caster are new mobs, but these these faces might be new mobs. <laughs> I 
<laughs> you little bastard. Alright. Shree's not playing Terraria, in case you wanted to know. <laughs> I always forget to turn that overlay off before I start playing. I really mean to. It's like I don't care if you guys see that stuff, it's just, uh. It's kind of distracting. This thing's really deep. It seems kind of linear, though, so that's not. That's one thing, I guess. That's something. Now, after I've said that, it's probably gonna, like, split up into, like, 15 different directions or something. really deep though. I didn't expect it to be so deep. I've probably made this too easy too by uh, having cool weapons and stuff. Definitely have plenty of reading material once I'm out of here. Cause yeah, hitting things for 30 is kind of overpowered, I guess. <laughs> oh, I wonder what the bones are used for. Something I have not seen before. These specs are kind of slow to break. I like how the mobs can just walk on the spikes. Jesus. Should have taken a lot of damage and not really noticed it. <laughs> I want to go this way up here. Those damn mobs keep spawning there. I guess there's really no point in collecting the spikes. It seems like a PvP item, but not a uh, not anything else. I was mainly just collecting them so I could get through up here. Invisibility potion. I wonder what that does. I mean, obviously it probably makes you invisible, but I mean, I wonder for how long, how it affects mobs. <laughs> That's cool. <gasps> Finally! Well, apparently the invisibility potion does not affect the ability for mobs to come and eat your face. That's kind of funny. Alright. Oh man, that was that was the best chest so far, it seems like. Where are they at? Like, what where did this chest come from? Like why the why the other chest not been anywhere close to this good? Somebody potion just fucking with my head. <laughs> uh I think the I think you can't set Got me throwing stuff on the ground. Um I don't think you can set the piggy bank down on just any random uh surface. I think it needs to be something like that. So, where's the piggy bank at? Archery potion. Increases arrow speed and damage. I didn't see myself pick that up. Did you guys notice it? <laughs> Fucked him up. And him. Damn, I'm kicking ass. Alright, let's find this fucking piggy bank. There it is. You son of a bitch. Get the hell out of here. We're, we're busy. We're doing stuff. Alright, piggy bank down. Alright, these water bolts can just go away. Well, I'll pick them up if I just throw them down there. Let's see what's in this chest. <laughs> and my ADD is out of control all of a sudden, ain't it? Uh... Big bone guys have a lot of hit points. Oh man, stop spawning for a second. Give me just a second. Ooh, an enchanted boomerang, man. I'm ooh, having a good moment. What is that? Oh, I guess there's just something on it. All right. Are you gonna just hang out down there, or what are you gonna do? Oh, okay, now now you're coming up here. All right. Fuck these mobs! I'll shut the door. That'll 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 show them. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to edit this out because this is ridiculous. All right, I don't know what the bones do, so I'll keep them. 
damage, four minute duration. That's cool. Um, where are the water bolts at? There's one. There's another. Put the boomerang. I think I can turn that into the flammer ring or something like that with the hailstone. Okay, these guys are pissing me off now. <laughs> they were cool for a second, and now there's too many of them. <laughs> Just non-stop. So, I'm going to... Close that wall up. Stop it. Until I can get my stuff organized and get out of here. Seems like a lot of them are spawning out there. <laughs> uh, I don't know what these bones do, but I'll put those in there. Uh, what else? I don't know how high the books stack. I'll just keep those. Slow falling speed, five minute duration. I should have read the invincibility potion to see what all it had to say. It seems like this orb of light goes out quicker now. Did that did that change? It's a lot of these bastards. What are the difference between the angry bones? There's probably a difference, like hit points or something. I didn't get a chance to really look. Wasn't paying attention to my life there. I could have died. <laughs> Why did I jump into that? It was something new in there that I haven't seen before. Oh Lord, have mercy! Oh my goodness! This bastard right here has got to die. There's the chest right there too. Stop shooting me, please! I don't want to get shot anymore. You're pissing me off. Oh man! Magic missile, 16 mana, cast a controllable missile. That sounds good. Stop it! Just stop it! <laughs> I need to put uh put these on my bar. Start leave a couple of these around. Just, just for the hell of it. I wish there wasn't a uh, that that right there, but that's okay. That spike did not did not pose the threat that I thought it would. Wow, let's spike up into that one though. <laughs> that was the uh, most dangerous spike ever, apparently. I feel like we're losing our linearness here. Oh man. Well, I guess I need so many water candles. Got out of the chest here. Like, these things aren't hard to kill or anything. They don't do a lot of things. But, like, a situation like this right here, I couldn't jump over there because that those bastards were there. I'll come back up here, please. He's just going to sit down there and shoot any. Oh, no, he's going to wait till I jump over there. Then he's going to come back up. <laughs> Oh yes, there we go. Cobalt shield, about time. Grants immunity to knockback. Let's put that on right now. That is what I wanted for so long. Where'd that bastard go? I was about to throw dynamite on his head. Oh, whoops. <laughs> oh, that was cute. It's really awesome that it doesn't do any damage to these walls in here. It's kind of cool to know. So, now you guys know. So you just dynamite is your friend while in here. I oh, mean, I thought I thought like I came out of the thing I just broke. Oh my god. Alright, I'm gonna have to cut off uh, steam. I'll be right back. Well, once I kill these mobs. I wonder if I can jump over that. 
Nope, cannot jump over that. I'm trying to get to a good spot to go cut off steam. <laughs> I guess there is one. What if there's a way in Steam to block communication from anyone you haven't accepted as a friend? There's gotta be. Um, not that I mind you guys contacting me, but there's so many ways to contact me already. Something that interferes with the gameplay is not my favorite of the ways to contact me. This thing keeps going out. It seems like really quick. I don't know if it is or not, or it's just in my head. That's a shitty place for a chest. Did you guys see that? <laughs> I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. I wonder what the best way to go about getting across those spikes are. Probably like... See the problem with trying to build something is uh... the whole... you can't... oh fucking hell man. <laughs> oh, That's the block that I just randomly placed up there to stop me from jumping. That's that's what stopped me from jumping. It's like what the hell stopped me from jumping? I guess I can semi-ignore these guys now that you can't knock me back. How's that feel? Blue moon. I don't know what that is, but I'll take that. <laughs> I like sometimes these things just come out of the woodwork. Alright, looks like we're done in this room. I know I'm leaving books and shit behind now all of a sudden, whereas I wasn't before. But it seems like there's just so many of them, it's like, what's the point of gathering them all? Unless you're going to make, like, freaking Library of Alexander. And you know, there was a chest back there I didn't get when I fell down that hole, and then I just ran away. That's kind of cool, band regeneration. There's all kinds of shit down here. This this is Chestopia. And I like Chestopia. Chestopia is is good. Stop hitting me. Finally, I got to where I was trying to go here. You know what I want to find? Or not find, uh, I want to get rocket boots from uh, the stupid goblin invasion. That's something that I've never seen. Just never gonna see. <laughs> it's like, I can't believe I haven't had a goblin invasion. This place is definitely not linear. It seemed like it at first, and then it just, everything changes. I think I saw a chest over there. Just gonna get all these first. Yeah, douchebag just popped his head out of a chest. Good here, Jester's arrows, some potions. Like, what was that? Thorns potion? What that does? Looks like a star. Attackers also take damage. That's that's cool. I could see uh, the use in that going. Uh, down to hell again. <laughs> I know I was gonna take damage, but I was like, whatever. I'll, I'll, I'll accept that. And this place is huge. No wonder no one's seen this shit on video. It's so big. It's like, how are you gonna put this in an episode? <laughs> Shut the door to his face. I probably like miss chests and stuff like that. I know that one chest I didn't grab that's down at the bottom of that one hole, and I planned on coming like right back. I didn't expect the next room to be all of this. <laughs> My aim is so bad with the sword. I kept trying to uh, deflect that blue thing that he was shooting at me. It's a water bolt. 
Oh, that block was there just to make you hit that, uh, <laughs> whenever you jumped. And I did not expect that to go way up here like this. This just, just keeps on going, like, it's just crazy. I feel like this should be like a boss room or something. Come in here and fight Dracula or something. There's nothing in this room, I guess. Nope, there's not. Except for some damage from some spikes. Well, guys, I think I've recorded my limit. Um, appreciate you guys watching and everything. Uh, thanks to everyone that's got me to my 3,000 subscriber mark. Um, <laughs> 7,000 more to go, and I'll have a contest to uh, let people join the server. <laughs> uh, next episode will probably be me finishing this place out. Um... And then, well, there's all kinds of stuff that just got added in this recent patch to check out uh, if you haven't seen it all done already by someone else. <laughs> um, and I'm going to try to keep doing what I've been doing as far as uploading Terraria on the weekends. Um, that is my plan, at least. So, let me uh, take some health. I was just not paying attention at all. It's just kind of running around here. Like, this is going to go down so far that I'm going to start having freaking worms and shit spawning in here. Or, uh, you know, the bitches that drop Star Fury or Sun Fury. Or Sun Fury. Star Fury. Some kind of Fury. <laughs> it's an angry weapon. Because we're at the lava level now, so how much further to hell? Oh shit. I didn't expect that to go up around like that either. This place is very unexpected. And uh, we'll probably have to start a new world here before too long because a lot of the stuff that got in this patch is new world only. And I want to see stuff that's that I don't see right now, so I will definitely start a new world eventually. Uh, more Hermes boots. Um. Anyways, I will see you guys in the next video.